Guys, this, in this episode, we are driving from Wilkenya yes. to Tilpa mm -hmm. on the Darling River Run. You. A personal favourite road of ours. Yes. Um, we're going to park up on the river hopefully tonight, maybe catch up the Abbeys. We don't know, it's going to be a fun, fun drive though. We love this drive. We do, we've been waiting to get by the river, so this is really exciting. Yeah. Let's go. It's closed, but I've spoken that they've graded it. So the, the road says closed, but we've spoken to the guys who have done all this work. And it's And the boss, I spoke to the boss, and they tell the council whether or not it's open or closed. It's looking beautiful. And he said, he said, mate, it's open. You can go, you can do it. Says closed on the site, but they said open to us. Old oh, mate, bloody um, Gary. Gary, who, who we were next to last night. Oh, okay. He runs all this, so he, he, he runs all the crews. So he runs all the guys. So he said that the guys are currently on here grading it, and they're doing about 16 k's a day, and they've been down here for the last week or so. So it's done, he said it's passable, people are driving it, he said it's, it's fine, but they say it's closed. Because you know they need to pretend, you know they need to base it on if an L plater in a two wheel drive hatchback does it. Honestly, that's what he said. He goes like he's got to base it on that. But he said you guys will be fine. You won't get bogged, and there's nothing Can wrong with doing. You get a fine from. You get a fine if you do so if like if it's blatantly wet and then you get bogged. What are you guys going to do? Said. Are you happy to go? Are you going to send the, you're going to send the combi up front? Going to go out and have a look at this. Yeah. So if we hadn't spoken to the authorities that have said that we can do it, we wouldn't be doing this road. I'll sort of point that out. Um, if it ever says closed or if online it says closed, we don't do it. But we've, take, we've spoken to all the, um, all the locals and the guys who are actually doing this. They said, mate, it's perfectly fine, um, but they just haven't updated the shire yet. So that's good and that's the only reason we're doing it. Just thought I'd point that out. Right, uh, Let's go. Take that. I was just saying earlier, Max. If, the, if the road says closed, we don't do it. But it's only because we've been told by the powers that be that it's safe to do so. And that's the only reason we're doing this road right now. Okay. No input there? Well, I wasn't there for the conversation. I yeah, trust. Yeah, it was, it was with, with Gary this morning. I trust you. And yeah. I can see why it still says closed. Obviously, if they're still, they want to make sure that they've completely finished it, maybe. Well, they're yeah, still, but the way he said, he goes, but well, he even said that we'd make it out through the T Tongo Tilpa Road. He goes, mate, it's flooded, but as long as you're not towing a caravan, you'll be fine. Okay. So that's what he said. So they're allowing it, but the reason they they put online closed is because they've got to. They've got to assume that it's a an L plater that doesn't have any driving experience in a hatchback with zero clearance. They need to make sure that everybody can drive it. They can't just assume everyone has the ground, the clearance, the right tires, and yeah. the driving and the driving ability to do a road like this. That makes so sense. So far, this is better than the asphalt road that we just did from Whitecliff. So far, but there is 140 k's that we need to do. So this is just the beginning. reason it takes so long for a lot of these roads to open out here is because they haven't got the manpower. Um, they all operate 
just out of Wilkenya and uh, out of White Cliffs. But most of them are brought in from out of town, so places like Coba, Broken Hill, so on and so forth. But um, that's why it takes so long sometimes to get all this, um, these roads sorted. Uh, is that a mirage or is that water up ahead? That's a mirage. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, it's bloody hot. So cool. It's so cool. It just suck the dust up into the air. You can still see it up there. there. So up ahead is the water truck. So the water truck's laying down water in the bull dust. Are you gonna say, well Gary told me? I am, I'm gonna have a chat with him. I, I wanna get I wanna get him. I think before find we find out go too far, let's you have a chat with him and just verify the conversation with Gary. Um what are you gonna do? I don't Good buddy, arm. Legend. Tell me, tell me, tell me. Um, here he goes, yeah mate, no, you'll be right. She goes, no, she's a sweet man, she's very passable. <laughs> she goes, yeah, he's like, yeah, don't, don't worry about it, mate. Bone dry, bone dry, mate. How good. Yeah. That makes me feel really good. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. Oh, hang on, we need to get on the channel with Chris. Was it? Yeah, yeah, talk to Chris. Oh. Where we know down? Okay. Oh. Hi. How are ya? Is he coming back down here? Oh, what? We just wait for him. Yeah. Yeah, all good. All good. I said it's sweet as. <laughs> I'm like stoked. Well, no, because I was just waiting because Max saw like, that because... she's like we're doing everything right. <laughs> we're doing everything right, but Switzerland still. Honestly, like, what? Well, we got every, everyone here's going, yeah, mate, all good. No, and she's was, still freaking. No, no, no. Oh, really? Well, I didn't know, like, Gary, I was saying, I trust you, Gary. But it was good to have confirmation from people who were on the road. That's right, yeah, mate. They looked at me and said, like, what a stupid question. I don't know. No, no, nah, it gets up to the Black Martin. It's oh, all right, but he said, yeah, it's sweet, does. Okay. All good? Thanks. Thanks, mate. coming from right because oh, no. you, you have a conversation right and you want to and obviously we're sharing this out to the public yeah and we like to do the right thing I always like to do the right thing in life yes and so that just makes me feel really good because guys who are on the job on the on the track right now have said yep all good yeah you're, you're all good to go but yeah without permission don't be doing it no you need the permission and double check right enough about the permission enough about all this, let's have a look at this amazing. Oh, look at the greenery! Up there. Wow. Running wild, nothing to lose. Do you remember the innocence of youth? Butterflies and summer skin, lightning. Exploding through roller coasters in your veins. Do you remember the never ending days? Every crush you ever had burned in your DNA with a sparkle in your eye, forever young.
down Every moment this is life, take it as it comes Jump up and reach for the stars Having no regrets forever and ever Always young, forever young Plenty of birds. There's plenty of life out here at the moment, isn't there? This is just so lush. I'm loving it. Look at them all. Oh yeah, all the So it gets a bit bumpy when you see the road kind of turn a bit rocky, then yeah, you'll see where. If you've got, a, if you plan on doing this trip or doing a trip, get a U, uh, UHF radio. 100%. It's, just a mask. Whether or not you're travelling with someone or not, you're able to communicate. Even um, with the people like we did before who were working on the road, it's, yeah. just, it's just a great tool to have and for emergencies as well. And if not, at minimum, like a really good um, CB radio. It's just something that you can um, still communicate but might not have the... the um, oh God. and that got me by surprise. Because, <laughs> um, tyre pressures. We we're, haven't let our tyres down at all. We've still kept, we've kept them at 55 PSI <clears throat> and that's purely based on that the road conditions are pretty good. Yeah. You can let them down and sure it's going to be a, a bit more comfortable but as far as, yeah, you keep them at 55 and then your fuel economy stays up a bit. And, like this we, is great. We, oh, this I is... think we know when we've got to let them down, and this has been fine. Oh yeah, no, this is this is pizza. Yeah, another road made for the combi. Yes. <laughs> Cobia is 190. Oh, tilt this that way. Yeah, I know, but there's what a back. What are you doing? Well, oh. I saw that, but look at that. 33 k's. They've obviously. No. Yeah, they've closed it, but they've just gone around it. Uh, mommy. Um, mommy. So, what have you got? 33 k's to tilt up. Yeah, mum. Where's that? That's your friend. Look at this, guys. Did you say that's not on the road? Well, you're right. Technically, it's not now because the road is now around it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, I yeah. feel like if we had to get out and move it, that's a bit different. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's you. So, yeah, guys, 33 kilometres to go. It's been a beautiful drive. Um, I'm ready to stop, though. I'm we are so ready to stop. So, we're going to pull up camp, I think, maybe there's, along the Darling. There's two options. You can either stay... Across directly the road. across the road from Tilpa the pub. We've done that before. Tilpa the pub. Oh, whatever. Is that his name? Anyway, sorry, sorry, sorry. You know what I mean. I oh, know what you. Anyways, uh, we the other option is which we really loved last time is we stayed right on the river, which is just a couple of k's away from um, the pub, and we really loved that because it was pretty relaxing there, and we had a you can kind of have a spot to yourself. 
still. Yeah, so I think that's probably where we'll stay. Yeah. We will visit the pub. We've got to visit the pub. Have to. Um, what makes Tupper Park quite unique is when you walk in there, you can write your name. Everyone that goes in writes their name on the wall. So you can you donate to the Royal Doctors Flying Service. Two dollars. Two bucks. They give you a texter and you've just got to find a spot. I'm telling you, it's hard to find a spot there, hey. <laughs> like, it is chockers. Our name, we'll show you where our name is. Um, it's, we got a cracking spot, didn't we? No one had we thought did. of the spot and I'm like, hey, can I put it there? And he goes, oh, yeah, all right. But another name on the wall, is Ivan Malat. Mm. Yes. Big big boy Ivo stopped out there for a schooner. And probably a snitty. 33 Ks, probably 30 Ks now I've been talking for so long. But let's go. He doesn't really care. He's looking at us like, what are you doing? Move! 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 Come on, guys. Thanks, fellas. Take your time. Thank you. Thanks, Trev. His Thanks. name's Trev. Woo! Oh. Thanks, Trev. Thank you. Thank you. Conjunctivitis, if you're worrying what's going on over there, she's getting some eye drops in. And my friends, we are here. Tilpa! Oh, I love this joint. Um, road closed the vehicles over three tons. That's that looks like that might be well, that's the way we've got to go for our camp. So we're okay, Chris will be okay down there too. Um, and we're just about to drive over the bridge now, and we'll get to the pub. Oh, hello, you beautiful thing.
you tell me where to go I'm not afraid to step outside and see the world for what it is now Spending all my time with people that I barely know You may have thought that I was lost But all I need is room to grow I'm coming home to put a flower in your hand But you should know there ain't no place I'd rather be instead I love you and I want to have the same. Is that okay? My dad can't have the same. No, he can't. He's not as special as us. It's our secret. Shh. And here it is, our favourite pub. You! Your favourite pub. Love it. My favourite pub. Our favourite pub. And same people are still here, <coughs> which is great. They remember same us. owners. They remember yeah. the combi. They went, Wait, what are you guys doing? You haven't been on the road for that long. Zuri's, like, yeah, since Zuri has how was, how was that for a drive? Yeah, it was good. All right in the caravan? Yeah, it was sick. <laughs> that, that was, how good was yeah, it? No, like, not as many bumps. No, that if was... If you get those washouts, it's hard. Yeah. No, the, oh, and the dust, it's that was... Names I loved it. Name? Yeah, you guys have to write your name on there. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. Two dollars. Two bucks, and you got to find a spot. Wait, check this out. Ready? Watch this. Grab it. Just up there. I'm up in the light. Oh, okay. <laughs> really? So we're yeah. in the doorway. Yeah, we're over here. Absolute murderer. Okay. Yeah, like. Yeah, once you open the doors, you can see it. Yeah, look. Look at really cool spot. Look. Look there we are. There we go. And right. Zuri. We're going to have to put another name there when we come back with a kid. Oh, 2020, 2021. Then we need to do 2023. You're going to put 2023 there now? <laughs> yeah. um, do you want to get a text up? Yeah, we need to get some cash out. Well, um, you're, not allowed, you're not allowed to go on the outside. So, how do I do plus uh, two, three? You can't ride on the outside of Yeah, you got to go. Just doing it there. That's ours there. Yeah, you can do it up there, but so, not where it's been freshly painted. Yeah, no, 100%. So, I think if I do 2023. Well, just here. Okay. Maybe here. Oh, here? Oh, no, here. Too small. Oh, do, do it down here. Oh, God. Oh, I can't even get my hand in there. Oh, what do you want me to do? No. Just come down the wall. I think it's upside down, so it's... There you go. Hang on, and then I'm just going to add a bit of pink so they can see it's us. You know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, there's another blue one there too, Max. There we go. What? There you go. That, that's the, the pink is the and the pink app. Oh yeah. The pink app. Oh gosh. Oh, it's like... Oh, it's coming down. <laughs> Hang on. I don't think these pens are made for going upside down. They're not an upside down pen. Now leave it as that. That's a bit of a tweak. I like that. All right. Done. 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 Well done. Your hands are more pink than the bloody wall. Oh, there's the blue. Morning. Chilpa pub, babe. Reminiscing, hey? That was great. I loved yeah. it. Yeah. I even went back through all of our old photos because first time we were there, Zuri was tiny as, like an absolute baby. Um, and then she was a toddler, and now obviously she's three years old. So it's really cool to reminisce. But yeah, if you want a true Aussie outback experience, this is one of the pubs that you've got to go to, that's for sure. And everyone there was absolute legends. Yes. What's up, Zuri? You do have teeth. You do have teeth. Anyway, so right now we're heading towards our camp, which is a free camp on the Darling River. Oh, good. We're heading there now. And um, it's beautiful. Do you know which way you're going? Uh, yeah. Are yeah. you waiting? I'm just waiting for um, Chris and Matt because they don't know where they're going. Okay.
Oklahoma. Remember, I remember you the rocks. You have a really good memory. I I'm said there are big rocks there. Drive. They're the rocks that you remember just there. And I said there's two big rocks right where you turn off. Your memory is amazing. There is oh. no way I would remember that. What about you say we're going to make a fire? We're going to make a fire and we're going to fishing. And, and we're going to get yabbies? Yep. And we're going to get yabbies. We're going to get yabbies. And what else are we going to do? Get yep fish. And we're going to have baked potatoes. And get fish. And what else? And what else? Fish. And what else? Fish. Wow, lots of fish. Yeah. That's going to be fun. Yeah. And, oh, what else? Fish. <laughs> more fish. There you go, I heard it straight from Zuri. We're going to get fish, fish. Fish and more fish. Yabbies? More, more yabbies. More, more yabbies. yabbies. Are you going to help collect all the firewood so we can have a really nice fire tonight? Is it lucky? Yep. Yeah. Is you going to have our fire? Yeah, I'm going to share it. Oh. That's going to be cool. Go. Here we go. We're getting close. I recall this. Are we going to have a God, this looks different. Woo, so uh -huh. lush and so green. Uh -huh. Look how green it is. It's amazing. It's, I mean, the water's, I don't think the water's as high as it was last time over here. Looks like we're on a... This is hectic. Wow. Didn't we camp that way last time? No, nah, we camped to the right, I believe, because we went past. No. Nah. I'm pretty sure we went to the right. No, nah. nah, we went Didn't we? We went left. Well, that's we overgrown. This... That side's overgrown. Everything's overgrown. overgrown. That's, that area is overgrown. We went the, down that road there. And it's all overgrown. Oh, look at all the birdies. Let's go have a look. There's going to be bulk birds, and bulk birds mean bulk fish. Oh, look at all the birds, Zooey. Oh, Woo! my. God, we are on like Donkey Kong. How's this for a spot? Bloody beautiful. Look at the bloody view. I just speared that one. Wow. Stop that. I'm not swimming across, I need to do his bodyboard. Oh. Ow. Here we go, baby. They are monsters. Holy mate, mate, yabbies. What do we do? 